the NBA play-in tournament is less than two weeks away, and for the first time since October 23rd, the Lakers aren't in the top 10 in the West. Russell Westbrook hinted that the pressure is piling on LA during a tense exchange with reporter Brad Turner of the Los Angeles Times following Tuesday's 128-110 loss to the Mavericks, which put the Lakers in the 11th spot in the West. When the reporter asked what changes the Lakers could make in the final stretch of the regular season, especially with LeBron James sidelined with a left ankle injury, Westbrook said he didn't have the answer. Then, he got up out of his seat and began to argue with Turner. I'm only one person, champ. It's a team game, he said. So I don't have an answer. You can give me your answer. After things seemed to get heated between Westbrook and Turner, the former league MVP de-escalated the situation by shaking reporter's hand. He then walked out of the room. The Lakers were without James in Tuesday's loss, after the 37-year-old hurt his ankle in the first half of Sunday's 116-108 loss to New Orleans. He landed awkwardly on the foot of Pelicans forward Jackson Hayes, and went down clutching his left ankle in pain, but remained in the game. After the game, James called the injury pretty nasty and said it felt horrible. He began receiving treatment at the arena that night, and exited with his ankle wrapped while walking with a limb. James, who is averaging 30.1 points, 8.2 rebounds and 6.3 assists this season, is the Lakers' leading scorer. Not only is his injury crucial for production on the floor, but Lakers coach Frank Vogel said it's much deeper than that. On Tuesday, Vogel described James' injury as the latest and maybe biggest blow to our psyche. The 31-44 Lakers currently sit in 11th spot in the Western Conference, outside of the final spot in the play-in tournament which begins April 12th and concludes April 15th. LA is now tied with the Spurs, who own a tiebreaker over the Lakers, with seven games remaining for both teams. James is reportedly expected to sit out Thursday in Salt Lake City against the Jazz. Meanwhile, Yahoo Sports' Chris Haynes reports Anthony Davis, foot, could return Friday against the Pelicans.